Hello, everybody. Welcome to episode nine of Haven Cave Block. Uh, today we start our journey into mystical agriculture. Hopefully, you enjoy this journey with me, and uh, see how it's done. Okay, guys. Uh, we have an issue here. Too much mob drops, not enough storage. Um, I mean, I like I like having the storage, okay? Or I like having the mobs farm running. Mm. To be honest, we only got done with the, this episode about three minutes ago. So... Uh, I want to get uh, more more interesting storage. So one of the things that was suggested to me is take a normal chest and turn it into an alchemical chest. Okay. And I'm not sure if that is going to do well. We need two of these, one of the, oof. Come on. One of these. Uh, and it looks like two stones. There we go. Okay, so we have the alchemical chest, which is a quest. So, let's see here one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen by one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Thirteen by eight is. A lot of storage. Um, brain's trying to do math here, which is hard to do. A hundred and hundred and four spots. That's, that's pretty beasty. Another thing we could do is sophisticated storage. I mean, it's super easy to get started. We just need to make um, upgrades. So let's do the upgrades. You're going to need redstone torches. Couple blocks of iron. Get us the iron tier. Um, Sixteen of these. Okay, so we take the iron tier ones. Makes gold. Sixteen of these, and that will make the diamond upgrades. And the next tier is even easier. We take some of this, get netherite scraps, um, four of these, or eight, eight in total, take uh, four of these, four of these, get our four netherite ingots, or, or two netherite ingots, and just add it 
and now we've got netherite storage. So let's let's put one of these on here. Okay. So this is a netherite chest, which is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve by one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So a hundred thirty two. So 132 storage compared to 100 and some. And with this, we can add stack upgrades. So let's, let's, um, I'm gonna make this first one, this one, this side, so we can just like put our stuff in here. Okay. Uh, stack upgrades. So we need some stack blanks. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five. Five of those. Um. Okay. So five bases, which is planks, iron. And the planks are what? Let's grab a stack of iron. More than enough. We're, we're going to definitely be using a lot more of these blanks than we're, we're making right now. So we've got the five blanks. And we want to make these stack upgrades. So this first one takes logs. So we'll take this here and put it in here. Got Stack upgrades one. Now that can fit, what is it, two stacks in one spot. Now if we go with this, which is iron, and of these, it doubles that even more. Don't realize how much storage you're going to need when you're not applying. Okay, so let's balance that out. Right, so we've got five of these on tier two. Tier four looks to be the highest tier, so let's make that. And of these, and let's just grab a stack of that. Fifth click that in there and now the diamond here again 10 and a little bit extra there we go now we've got four or five tier four which means each stack can hold 16. One in there, if we do this, already lowers it down by a lot. You can see that it can hold like a thousand uh, arrows in one spot. But if we do this, the arrows now show 16. Oh! Only two stack upgrades can be used in the oak netherite chest. Okay, so only two stacks can be combined. Okay, okay, that's fine. That's fine. Um, but now, like the witch's hat, second stack, 
can hold like six, oh, 256 of them. The armors can stack somewhat. Bows, ones with the same damage. But this, this will let us store a lot more stuff in there. And, um, let's see here. What else can we do with these? Uh, blasting, smoking. I think there's a compacting one. Uh, I'm just trying to remember all the stuff that we need. Uh, crafting. Oh, that's just crafting table. Uh, there is a compression upgrade. It's automatically compress, decompress items. Uh, stuff that can be uh, compressed together. You can add workbench upgrades into them. So I think... I like this. I like the ability to store all of this stuff here, and we're getting some of these plushies here. Let's see if we're, we get lucky here with any good plushies. We, we got uh, Heavy Weapons Guy plushies, Isaac plushies, a Blizzy plushies, a Crewmate plushie. So, yeah. I think it's time to upgrade all of uh, these chests here uh, to sophisticated storage. And before we get done with that, I'll, I'll see what next we can do with this episode. Okay? Be right back. All right, um, I cleaned out all of these guys, and uh, it fits into these two right here. Very simple, very easy, simple, easy, like all of these. This can finally be moved, I guess. Get up here. And I figured I want to get up started on very own. Uh, farming. But before I do that, I need some wheat seeds. So we're going to go get some wheat seeds from uh, using a couple pieces of blanks here. And five of these guys. And then wool dyed. And I will use deep root to do that. Get the red dye, red wool, red wool. Now we can request a marketplace. Um, as they set in right there. And uh, these will go Meat seeds. Oh, we can get andersite alloys from him for diamond. Brass nuggets for emeralds. Slime balls for emeralds. Kelp, diamond. Alright, that's kind of cool. Uh, wheat seeds. Okay, I want two of those. The reason why is one, we're going to need wheat seeds later on for this particular mod. But I would like to make a. So this will get us the wheat and stuff that we need over here. I'll have to move you guys. I'll have to move you soon. soon. Um, but this. We need wheat here to round you with that and get this Inferium seed. Take this Inferium seed and put it into a hopping botany pot right here. Wait, can we not? 
put this in popping botany pots? No, because you need particular dirt to do it. Uh, if you saw, it requires a farmland. You get farmland in your inventory. Uh, we'll take this pot so it should work. Take this. No, we, we do need the help. Oh, dirt. We get farmland. But if we add Inferium to it, we would get Inferium farmland. Or if we add Prudentia to it, we will get a Prudentia farmland. Uh, the one that we really want to do is Supremium because this actually will produce uh, faster seeds for us. So we'll put that in there. Put the Inferium seed in. And watch it. You see how it growth kicks a lot faster. And we can still right click it. Get Inferium instances. Now, we're going to make. Uh, I want to get to the Master Infusion Crystal as quickly as possible which is two Supremiums with a Prosperity Gem. Prosperity Gem's just a diamond surrounded by Prosperity Shard, if you didn't know. Uh, and four Prosperity Shards and four Supremium Essences. So we need a total of six Supremium Essences. And the way we're going to do that is by using a lower tier fusion crystal. We take this, we can get 16 of those, we'll balance this all out. Okay, we have 26 of the Prudentia. Now if we do this, we'll get 6 of the Tetrium. And this will make one Imperium which will get us one below the Supremium Essence. See that, that is a bunch of quests here in the Mystical Agricraft. Um, we want to get to the Awakened soon, but that requires uh, pulling off the Wither. And we got to save the durability of this because this does not repair with a repair talisman. So uh, let's gather the quest that we have and see how far we are done. We just got some Inferium. We've got a bunch of XP. Milk drawer, hopping botany pot. Got a B plus sheet. So that should give us more one more quest. Slice of chocolate pie. Alright, so let's put away this stuff. Go in here. So might want to make a drawer just or a chest just for the plushies. Uh, I am going to take some bone meal here. And try to grow this as fast as possible to get the essences that we need. Not going as fast as possible, but uh, that is where the next improvement comes in. We will take one of these inner pearls, two diamonds here. Uh, pick this guy up, open it up, take those out. Uh, 
grab our pickaxe, which is right here. Pick this up. Go into this. This, with two diamonds and one ender pearl, will get us an elite hopper. Okay, let's pull out all the Imperium that we have up. Place this back down. Place that there. And that was one growth tick. And you notice how there we get two for that instead of the standard one. Yeah, that is fantastic. Uh, Elite hoppers, I think, turn into creative hoppers. Um, no, they turns into the ultra hoppers. But we need another star, and looks like more terracotta. Or another star in two blocks of emeralds. So, let's see here. Yeah. It's just uh, two blocks of emeralds. And another star. Don't think we have access to Nether Stars just yet. So the Ultra Hopping Bot Defense. Yeah, there we go. Ultra Botany Pots can be turned into the Creative Botany Pots, which requires an essence of Haven, which we're not up to yet. I mean, that takes a lot of essences right there. All right, so I'm going to, like I said, I'm going to spend some time building up some Imperium essences. And uh, hopefully, hopefully we will have enough of these to get this soon. So I'll be right back with that. Okay, after a few hours of uh, in-between time, uh, I've gotten, should be enough Imperium Essence. Uh, we've been getting it from here, as well as over at the mob farm, as you can see. Uh, I've been cleaning this up, putting the armors and bows over here. Uh, just, you know, just so I can figure out what I wa really want to do with it. If I want to keep them or not. So that has like 600 some uses left. Which is fine by me. Okay, so just a little bit more of this. Okay, so now there we go. Balance that out. Get that there. That I think this should be enough of this uh, supremium essence. Just barely. Just barely enough of this Supremium Essence to do this. So we grab one of these and eight of these. Doing so, we can uh, make a Prosperity Gemstone. Turn that into a Supremium Gemstone. With the Supremium Gemstone, probably prosperity shards and more of that we get the master infusion crystal uh 
uh, the Master Infusion Crystal does not have duration or durability. So now we can also let's see here. Do not see any more of that in there. So the next thing I want to do will we. Uh, if you guys did not hear that, that's my friendly editor. No, that's your friendly editor. Not oh, okay, okay. That's your friendly editor who loves to, to, to post comments like she's probably doing right now on this uh, video in post-production. Who, who, who is saying self in the background right now? All right, so now we should also have, oof, only six seats. Can we get those, the, uh, oof is oof. Okay, so we only have six of these seats. So this is this is not friendly. Um, now let's go over here to at mystical, and we want the infusion altar and eight of the pedestals. The infusion altar is four stone, one red wool, and two gold. So. Looks like we're going to need a total of nine feet roots. Um, go over here. Feet. Feet. Feet root seeds. Uh, got feet root seeds. I just want a hopping botany pot, which we have still in our inventory. A piece of dirt. We'll keep that on us. Set this down here. This, and we'll put the beetroot seed in this. And like I said, we need nine beet roots. There we go. Now that we've got beet root seeds, we're good. So. So stone. Ah, here, here's our stone. Okay. We need not be so confused after that lovely interruption that we've had. Get the nine white wool. Turn these beetroots into red dye. Make these into these red wools. These get gold ingots, so 18, 20 gold. I need a little bit more stone. So there we go. One, two, three, four. The red wool there. And two of these will get us the infusion altar. We also need, yeah, like I said, we need more stone. Um, six. Need eight, so I need two, five, five. Well, while we're starting to make these, first seven of them done. One more, there we go.
and there. All right, uh, we've got the infusion altar. I think we're going to need a space for the infusion altar. Because, if I'm not mistaken, to... yeah, here and here, or no, here, here, would be where those spots would be at. Yeah. So we'll take, we'll set this aside for right at this moment. I'll just utilize the space that we have until uh, I can create a place for this. Um, one of the things I like to do is make a redstone block. Pick up this infusion altar, put the redstone block right in the center there. And that way, uh, once we get all of the stuff down in it, it automatically starts processing. Uh, if I can find my clipboard, I I'm pretty sure she's going to point it out in this video if she sees it. Put down the clipboard somewhere and I cannot seem to find it. I had a list of seeds I wanted to produce. Uh, first and foremost. And I cannot seem... Ah, here it is. Alright, uh, quartz seed, stone seed, wood seed, dye seed, earth seed, air seed, fire seed, water seed. I'm not going to make all of these one chan- uh, uh, not going to make all of these on this video. Uh, I'll probably do it between episodes. Uh, the But the very first one I want to make is the stone seed. Stone is just four stone, like so. Uh, some Imperium Essence in the other four spots. And the seed there. And that does not work. Why does that not work? Uh, stone seed. Okay, we can look here because it's got to be prosperity seeds. Okay, Let's see, Mal Malcor forgot that. That's why we have so much for prosperity shards. Uh, we take this, surround it by seed, uh, surrounded by prosperity shards. There we go. Now we got our stone being made. Uh, and that would have given us a quest completed if we had one other quest completed beforehand. And that particular quest is the dirt there, this there, and the Imperium farmland. Okay, there we go. Now we got stone seeds being registered. Uh, the next one is the wood for for oak logs, and uh, I was showing you guys the way the book says to set them in there, but honestly, you can set them like that, put that there. It doesn't matter which order you put them on, which pedestal you put them on. So we got wood seeds stone seeds uh, and 
Uh, quartz seeds. That's the next one I was going to show you guys. Quartz. I know we have eight quartz or sixteen quartz. Uh, we need at least four quartz for this because uh, if you look at the recipe for these, which is hover over it, press R. You'll see it takes another quartz essence. Another quartz essence is a tier three seed, so we need to use tetrium uh, essence. We only have three tetrium on us. We could uh, improve this to tetrium, or we could take our uh, imperium essence here and lower it down to tetrium by decrafting. Um, another thing is you don't need to put the prosperity seeds there last. As long as the recipe could flow as soon as the last item is on one of these pedestals, it will flow into the nether ports. That did not get made into seeds because, yet again, we need to make the Tetrion farmland for that to register. Uh, we also will need the Prudentium farmland and the uh, Imperium farmland. And that completes a bunch of those quests. I'm going to set these up on a uh, chest here get the rest of these seeds done, the earth, air, fire, water ones. Uh, I will show you guys what those are used for in a later episode. Uh, also, the dye seeds is also another one that I want to make. Um, so, yeah, there we go. We started that. Got those done. Uh, and I will finish this up between episodes get those made I might make dirt seeds as well because you know we're gonna need dirt we're gonna need a lot of dirt and it's a lot easier to make dirt that way than uh, with the um, with the sit gravel method so I will get those done between episodes, and until next time, uh, I would love to show you guys an idea I have for this. I might do it between episodes. It's just add a trash can filtering system for the army, just so I, I, I don't get that stuff in there anymore. Um... But yeah, until next time, y'all, you have a great rest of your day. Uh, if you like this episode, go ahead, hit that like button. If you dislike this episode, go right ahead, hit that dislike button and tell me why you disliked it. Uh, if you have any comments down below, go right ahead, leave the comments down below. Helps me out. Improves the, uh, improves my knowledge of the game, which makes for a better, uh, time for you guys. And until then, later, Gators. <laughs>